Welcome to the first of main very late reviews on this channel for 2020. Because you know I'm not going to be seeing any new movies nowadays. <sighs> Onward is the next Pixar movie that has been advertising. It's been a few weeks. Obviously it's not in theaters anymore so I can talk about it now. Uh, this is the next Pixar movie. stars Tom Holland and Chris Pratt. Uh, Ju uh, Julia Lee Dreyfus, I think that's how you pronounce her name. And Octavia Spencer. And in this film we see two brothers trying to find a way to get their father back for at least one day. After they find the spell, this wand in their attic. And we follow them through this journey. And it's an adventure movie. This is kind of a weird movie for me to get excited about. I wasn't too excited for this movie. Uh, it just felt weird. It's original, which I'm happy about. And the film does do a lot of original things. But I wouldn't say I was over the moon excited for it. I'm not as excited as Soul. Soul, I'm so excited for it. That's that, that, that looks like a Pixar classic in the making. But this movie, I was a little worried about. And I like to say, yeah, I was surprised, and I was. This is a very enjoyable Pixar movie with two excellent performances from Chris Pratt and Tom Holland, who are easily the best part about this movie, alongside with the fantastic animation, which you could say clashes with the cartoony animation with the background. The background is stunning, and it's similar to, like, Good Dinosaur or Monsters University, except this is million times better than both those movies, both in animation and quality. For me, I'm not a big fan of Monsters University. It's fine. It, it's it's okay. But Good Dinosaur is definitely up there to be my least favorite of Pixar's movies. But it's not an awful movie. It's not Course 2. But onward, in my opinion, I think it's a really fun movie. And... I don't know, I... I what, what, what else can I say that's really positive? Oh, well, I like uh, Octavia Spencer's character. I think she was a lot of fun. And she has the best humor in the film. I I'm, try I'm just trying to see if like I can say anything else positive without getting too negative. Because I don't really hate this film, actually. I was surprised, and I had a lot of fun with it. It's a very enjoyable film. I guess I sound a little too negative because I expect a lot more from Pixar. But as a film itself, it's really good. It's really good. But for Pixar, it's mid to lower tier, I would say, for me. It's, I would say, under Incredibles 2, but above Finding Dory. Uh, reason being why I say that is because, for one, I don't think the humor, unless it's coming from Octavia Spencer's Manicore, I didn't think this movie was all that funny. When the quest starts, I was not that invested as it continued on until we'll get to the ending a little bit. But I wasn't too invested in that. And three... Ah, it took me a while for me to get invested in the brotherly characters or their brotherly bond. Because its biggest point is... These two brothers trying to bond, trying to get their father back. Reason being is that I wasn't too invested in why they wanted to get there. Well, I did understand. I didn't understand. I didn't really. The plight was there, but I was not invested enough for me to care. The brothers themselves are fine characters. I do believe their bond by the end of the movie and by the end of the movie, I did get emotionally wrapped. Not as as much as I would want to, but it's, it, it was investing enough for me to actually say I like the ending. I really do. The ending and the beginning are my two favorite things in this movie, uh, plot-wise, structure-wise. Middle half drags a little bit. It does drag. But for all, all I can say, Onward was a very fun movie. And I think I'll go back and rewatch it maybe one more time to see if I like it even more. But for the time being, I think I'm going to give Onward a 7 out of 10. Let's go with that. 7. It's, 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 yeah, it's 7. So, 
if you guys enjoyed this review and if you've seen it on more, let me know. And I'll see you all later, Kurds. Take care.